I've left the fascinating port town of Haiphong and I'm heading inland to the bustling capital, Hanoi. The passages on this leg are far more business-like compared to being on the regional and coastal journeys. I really love the antique, modern feel of Hanoi. I always seem to have a, a heightened sense of excitement every time I visit this romantic city. Now, it's a quick two-hour train journey from Haiphong to Hanoi, and I'm really looking forward to arriving. Hanoi is located on the Red River and is the second largest city in Vietnam, Ho Chi Minh being the largest. The antique modern feel of Hanoi is obvious and you walk around this international city and you must walk because there is simply so much you will see that you'll miss by car or motorbike. And there's one dish that I always have to have as soon as I arrive to Hanoi. And no, it's not pho, it's actually mun cha. This beautiful, iconic dish of Hanoi is absolutely stunning. Now, it's been around for 40 or 50 years now, but it's only been made world famous by two guys, Barack Obama and Anthony Bourdain. Now, they ate here not long ago, maybe a few years ago now, and it's called Hương Lien Restaurant, right in the center of Hanoi, and they sat Right there. Now Barack Obama sat there, Anthony Bourdain sat there, ate their little buncha with a beer Hanoi. And their table has been encased now in glass. It's enshrined, it's a, it's a monument. Wow, look, it's commercialized now. There's a lot of tourists here, it's busy, but the buncha itself is very good. And what I've ordered here is actually called an Obama combo. But you know what? All that aside, the buncha is very good. And I do expect after I finish this meal, I want an encased glass box as well. Thank you. <laughs> when I receive a tip of some local food to try, there's always a hidden twist behind its location. Like, go to the alley behind the basket shop or follow your nose once you hit this corner. And a few years ago, I was told about this little gem I'm going to share with you. I'm in the old quarter of Hanoi, also known as Pho Ko. Now, I really love walking through the streets of the old quarter because you can really see the French Indochina architecture. Now, this whole quarter used to be the residential, manufacturing and commercial hub of Hanoi, where each street was specialising in a certain product. And each street was named after that product, all 36 streets. Now, here I'm on Hang Quoc, where they used to make fans back in the day. Now, I'm not here for fans, I'm here for the bun cha. So I've already shown you where Obama eats bun cha. I'm gonna show you where I eat bun cha. This is the legit bun cha of Hanoi. Now, I've been to this place so many times, but I always still have trouble finding it. Ah, here it is, number 74, Hang Quoc. Now, there's no sign, really. You just smell the aromas of the bun cha cha grilling. You can see the smoke, xin chào. Look at this, really, really narrow lane. He's one of the bosses here. I love this place. People sit here during lunchtime. All the vermicelli noodles are here. And all the grilling takes place right on the lane. Look at this, in chow. Oh, oh. <laughs> all of the, the pork is chow good. Pork belly, little pork patties as well. They're deep frying some spring rolls as well with crab inside. Courtyard, residential upstairs, 74 Hang Quoc. You gotta check it out. At its heart, Bun cha is grilled pork, rice noodles, herbs, and fish sauce, all in one bowl. What a combination. Now, um, the locals here, or the, the owner here, Ko Lan, wouldn't tell me what's in her marinade for the bun cha. Of course, right? It's an age-old recipe. So this is my version of bun cha. Hopefully, it'll be even close to her recipe. This is my favorite place in Hanoi. I find this place the real deal, right? The authentic bun cha. Not so much for tourists, but for the locals. And only locals could find it because it's so hidden and secret. Okay, so this dish, really, really simple, actually. Um, there's a lot of different components, however, the marinade is very, very easy. And while the pork belly and pork mince are marinating in two separate bowls, I add fish sauce, oyster sauce, and black pepper. The secret to buncha 
is this, the caramel, right? That caramelized sugar down and it gives that beautiful dark color. Tiếng Việt cái này kêu bằng gì nước nha nè? Nước hàng. This is called nước hàng in Vietnamese. And any bún cha has to have it. Gives it that color and that sweetness as well. So when you're char grilling it, it caramelizes. Now I'm going to put in the spring onion that I just sliced. I've also got some diced red Asian shallots and garlic as well. And the last bit is some garlic chives. Oh, this gives a really nice flavor. Now you just need to mix it all together. All right, now that's looking good. Now I'm going to get one of these wire grills. I just love these things. Essential for grilling. Open the grill. I have to have this dish every day when I'm in Hanoi without fail. But this has to be one of my favorites. It's all very good, but this, this place does it really, really well. Now I'm ready to do my little pork patties. Not too big, just little ones like that. A little mouthful, that goes on there. Flip her over and brush the other side. And I'm gonna take this to the ladies down there, laneway to char grill. Now, oh, now if you look behind me here, this is the mother goddess. This whole residential area here worships her. And how they worship her, they come, they pray, they light incense, but they also offer food as well. But not only just food, there's money, well, there's, there's cigarettes, there's vodka, coffee, Pepsi, cola, and there's also beer. Wow. Look how beautiful this scene is, guys. Wow, they're so busy here. I've got to put mine in line. Now you want to throw them directly onto the charcoal. You want those burnt blackened parts because that is so good. Crispy, burnt flavor. Four minutes on each side and it's done. <laughs> All right, look, I'm going to get some pork belly into my bowl. So good, thank you. These are the parts that you want and cannot resist. Mmm. So good. Okay. Go away. Chút 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 đu đủ nha. Đu đủ. So green papaya. Remember, some carrots and this lovely light fish sauce goes in. Come mom. Got to weave around. I've got my bowl, mate. I've got my red tray there. Vermicelli noodles. Lettuce, bean sprout, perilla, mint. This is the authentic buncha of Hanoi.